All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K22, lots of news and all that stuff, man. They dropped it. We're not going to do the course side report unless y'all just want me to go through that. I felt like it was more interesting to go through Mike Wong's, uh, where he did it on TikTok, and we're going to watch that video. Then we're going to come back, and we're going to just kind of go through it. I'm going to get my thoughts on it and all that good stuff, man. So if you don't do nothing else, man, make sure y'all like this video, man, because every like gets us closer to that oh so coveted 100k man we almost there we so close i can taste it anyway man let's just get right into the video Lito! you make it to c25 that's og status i was told you could be anything just don't be average down bad flat pockets that shit made me upset start hustling non-stop don't plan on breaking that head all right so right off the bat man check it out um y'all already know what it is man breeze tees Y'all know what the site is, man. Breeze is going to come in here in a second, so don't worry about that. Breeze Tees, you got the site. Custom Tees, custom merch, all that good stuff, man. We're going to start dropping the Trill City merch and all that soon, but that ain't what we're here for. What we're here for, man, is we're here for, uh, well, Karen Lawson. Karen, I mean, not Karen. What I'm talking about, Karen Lawson. I don't even know why I got that on the brain. Candace Parker ain't what we're here for either. We're here for Mike Wong and what he got to say about this, man. Let's just get right into it. First off, I know somebody gonna say, yeah, Jay, you're saying Wong, but he said, he's saying Wong. He's saying Wang to be polite because he knows that y'all don't know how to pronounce his name. You know, you know, we, we got a lot of people that's like that. They'll just let you pronounce it and they get tired of correcting you. So since they tired of correcting you, they will just, just, they'll just say it the way that you say it. I'm not one of those people, okay? My name is Smith with three Fs. You're gonna pronounce it with three Fs. Let's go. First up, gameplay on offense, breaking down defenders off the dribble, with new signature moves and combos, precision jump shooting, dunking in traffic, and pulling off alley oops have all become more skill based. On defense, we added a completely revamped shot Sound good. blocking system, highlighting a number of new defensive tools at your disposal. Seasons will expand to not only my team, but my career and the W, bringing more content, more awards, more ways to play, and a brand new way to level up your my play. Now for part, PS5 and Xbox Series X and S players will step into an all new version of the city that also has a new quest system, matchmaking options, and more. PS4 and Xbox One players will set sail on an all new dedicated basketball community, a neighborhood built on a sailing cruise ship. For my career on PS5, mm. Xbox Series X and S, the all new city and the my career story become one in a groundbreaking narrative experience with okay. new features like hidden talents, an upgraded home lifestyle, and more. On PS4 and Xbox Series One, players will also get a whole new My Career experience. My team for NBA 2K22 evolved as the ultimate experience for building and competing with your own dream team on day one, adding My Team Draft as well as even more additions coming throughout the year, including an original all new game mode this holiday season. Stay tuned for more 2K22 updates. Hey, all right so check this out man now look we saying stay tuned for more 2k22 updates what we're gonna do is we are going to go through the video and um you know i'm gonna give my thoughts as he says what he's gonna say let's just get to it it's mike wang and today i'm gonna talk about what's new in 2k22 first up gameplay On was he trying to drop bars right there new in 2k22 bars down defenders off the dribble with new signature moves and combos, precision jump shooting, dunking in traffic, and pulling off alley oops have all become more skill based. All right, so he's saying all this stuff has become more skill based. I'm worried about the precision jump shooting. I just want to know what it actually is precision jump shooting and all that good stuff. So he says that a lot of this stuff is more skill based, and from what we were seeing, what Swante was saying, it's going to be more stamina based as well. So it's not like the, the biggest problem I think that everybody had with the game this year was simply this. You could be, you could be like, like going, you, you're trying to, you, you're trying to play the game. We, we sitting here playing great defense and all of that good stuff. I'm trying to get this thing moved to where I want, want it to, but, uh, we're playing great defense and the guy you bumping, you getting bumpy with him. You bumpy Johnson out here, you bumping him. He can't get by you. And then he gets close enough to the rim. We don't, we still don't even know why you even think it's a good idea to press square or X or what have you. And they give them the dunk. I think that's been everybody's biggest issue. We don't care if like if you get a free run to the rim and you take off and you just hide, just you know what I'm saying? Like nobody really cares about that. I think the issue that everybody cared about the most was that you were able to just just take off at on on a whole group of people. It could be three people down there, you don't even know, you still gonna go up and make the layer. So if stamina is tied to that, 
then it is what it is, man. Like, I, I hope there's something good because, you know, if it's stamina tied to it, then it's going to make it so that you can't just go up in traffic and you can't just take a bad jump shot just because you finally got open and you got no stamina or whatever. Like, so hopefully it's going to play a bigger key. I don't know if they're going to tie the stamina or not, but they say going up and going up on defenders and traffic and all this stuff is going to be more skill based, not as brain dead. I'm for it if they, if they do it properly. Let's get to the next part. On defense, we added a completely revamped shot contest and blocking system, highlighting a number of new defensive tools at your disposal. Season. Now, defense, new blocking system, new all of that, bro. Uh, we watched the, we already watched the video. Everybody else dropped the video with the guy talking about, um, you know, you're not going to be able to crowd people anymore, and you're not going to be able to, um, you know, you're going to have to actually learn how to dribble and stuff, and defense is going to be, I hope, hopefully it's not suffocating and stifling defense like it was on 2K22, I mean 21, I mean 20, when like you just, you, you pick a lockdown on 19 or 20 and then the person just can't do anything. I hope it's not like that, but if it is, I hope it's skill based. Can we get them defensive stances that y'all told us that we were going to get? Because we said, you, know, you said we were going to get that, so can we get a defensive stance so I can play defense like Kawhi and all of that good stuff, or like LBJ or whatever like that. Also, um, you know, with the crab thing i'm cool with y'all doing it and making a new defensive system and a new block system and all that good stuff where you can contest from behind and all that stuff or crab dribble doesn't work exactly like it did but this is the problem that i got with it I, i'm gonna be honest with you i don't know if i have faith in 2k's ability to pull it off properly and when i'm saying that i'm saying that the whole reason that they started the crabbing in the first place a lot of people forget that on other 2k's the contest from behind it was a thing but it was crazy like like i could have beat you all the way up court and then i'm taking the jump shot and you just press the jump button from behind me 30 feet behind me so just like how we have people jumping from the paint to the three-point line and they're getting a 50 percent contest that used to happen in 2ks where you the guy would be behind you and then he just jump at you from behind and it gives him a contest now on layups and stuff i can understand that kind of a little bit but on jump shots like that's what i'm saying i don't have faith in 2k's a bit that's the whole reason that they made it the crab and all that stuff anyway where you couldn't get a contest from behind and then they made it so so now you can dribble the guy into it and all that good stuff so it's it's if they implement it properly then it'll be fine but i just don't know if i got the 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 i don't know if i have the um confidence that they can do it properly because as good as it sounds that if I'm standing on top of your feet right behind you, you can't just go up with it. I just think that we're going to see some of that where you're going to be by the dude and the dude is down court. He's going to be at, he's going to be sitting here at the, uh, you know, you're going to be at half court. Can y'all see my mouse? I don't know if y'all can on that. Anyway, you're going to be at half court and the guy is going to be shooting the three and you're going to be at half court. And you're going to jump at it from behind. It's going to give you a contest. I just don't want to see that. But you know, other than that, hey, do what you gotta do, uh, Mikey. Let's let's get to the next part. Seasons will expand to not only my team, but my career and the W, bringing more content, more awards, more ways to play, and a brand new way to level up your my play. Now for part Mike, we know y'all be in my stream and watch all my videos, bro. At this point, we know it. It's confirmed. This is something that I talk about with Brute at nauseum on his stream and all of that, saying that we gotta have seasons because at this point if you're not the first like the road to legend y'all let me know down in the comment section do y'all feel this the road to legend at this point in gaming does more to to discourage people from playing the game than it does to incentivize them to continue to play the game and what i'm saying is like the whole thing like 10th prestige and all of this stuff like getting to the end of a very long road that's an antiquated way of, of grinding like yes you do get that and yes you can still have that but some people stop playing the game because once they realize they're not going to get mascots they just like i'm done with it so seasons seasons are the perfect thing to do and i said it on brute stream i said it on my stream i've said it that, listen we already have so many things that are just innate in the game one of the things that's just innate in the game is you got the, you, we already know we're gonna have the city and we're gonna have the city we're gonna have the uh the the mayor elections so just make the seasons coincide with the with the mayor uh the mayoral elections about six weeks each season is about six weeks we you already know we say that the, the rewards suck 
as far as grinding the legend and stuff like that so people are not really going to grind the legend but if you have dope season rewards like in call of duty where you get another gun or you get this or that it's like i was saying like it's stuff that's already in the game let me pick a, a nba player's face or you know that i can have access to let me get a um let me get a black mamba face man let me get an ai face let me get you know uh, um you know so when we make these players let me get a um let me be able to uh, get a, 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 a Brody face, anything like something like that. This is stuff that's already in the game. Let us get some of this gear. Let us get all of this stuff, man. It's just so, it's so crazy. The stuff that's in the game that people would want to, would want to have. Like I would want to have, like some people want to come out there like Mike Jordan. Let me get a Mike Jordan face. Let me get some of this stuff and put it on here so that these rewards can be dope. And the best part is with the seasons, and the season rewards, you don't have to worry about people just saying, hey, these rewards are trash because you can continuously up the rewards and you can listen to the community and you can implement these rewards you know, so it's season rewards instead of rep rewards. You still have the persistent rep over time that, yes, these are going to be decidedly better rewards, but at the same time, you will have it so people can people will be able to, uh, you know, I can just rip up this season and I still got a reason to play because a lot of times it's like, bro, I don't have no reason to play right now because the rep rewards are garbage. But if I come in and this season rewards are dope, I'm gonna play all this season, I'm gonna fill out that pass, you're gonna have more people on to the game. So that's, I just don't understand why it's a win, 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 no matter what. But uh, you know, let's let's see what else Mikey's talking about. Like I said, this this is my idea. Y'all stole that one. I ain't cap. I'm taking full credit for that one with the NBA players' faces and the body styles and all that. Next up. Xbox Series X and S players will step into an all new version of the city that also has a new quest system, matchmaking options, and more. PS4. New quest system matchmaking. Now listen, bro, the quest system was the dopest thing in there. I enjoyed not having to go to my career in order to rank up my players this year. I hope it's the same way this year with the juice and I hope it's the same way this year with the warehouses and all that where you can rank up your player and uh, and get that all new progression. I think they saw that that was a W, so maybe that's gonna be the all new way to progress your player this year because my career is antiquated. Yes, you still have to grind it, but let us do something that we actually want to do to grind these guys and not have to get our record scuffed up in uh in order to do it. And then also uh the city, I right, city's back. They say everything's gonna be integrated. You're gonna be able to see new new abilities and all that stuff. Hey, yo. I hope the hidden abilities are just for my career. I hope hidden abilities don't come up actually in game, in game, but you know, we'll see. And Xbox One players will set sail on an all new dedicated basketball. I will tell you this. I am not happy that they're actually putting effort into current gen. Like I thought it was just gonna be a spinoff game or like a little whatever. Bro, they actually putting effort into current gen. If they're actually putting effort into current gen, that means that we're gonna have, that, that that really opens the door. I mean, I'm gonna get both games anyway because it's free. Uh, it's gonna be free for me. You're gonna get both versions. But if they're actually putting putting that putting that effort in the current gen, that pretty much means that we definitely have the, the potential for the community to be split again. But uh, let's get it. Neighborhood on the on the uh, ship, and like we said, they're gonna have seasons on on uh, current gen too, because they said it's gonna dock in the different seasons, and you're gonna be able to do the different stuff. Maybe we're gonna get that Shanghai Park. Maybe we're gonna get the, uh, all those other things that they said that that, that we were supposed to get, um, you know, in 2K22 that we never really got. So maybe that's gonna be that. Y'all, let me know what y'all think. The Xbox Series X and S, the all new city, and the My Career story become one in a groundbreaking narrative experience with new features like hidden talents. An upgraded home lifestyle and more. On PS4. That upgraded home lifestyle does sound good. Players will also get a whole new my career experience. My and that whole new my career experience sounds pretty good too. I'm not gonna lie, but but you know hidden talents and all that. We gonna see. We gonna see, man. That's the ultimate experience of building and competing with your own dream team on day one. Adding my team draft as well as even more additions coming throughout the year including an original all new game mode this holiday season stay tuned i will tell y'all this my team drafts it was already there it's just like madden draft champions and then you know used to have um osn and and uh cash they used to do something similar like do it on their own uh you know with the packet play type videos and stuff like that so that's not nothing that's new um actually it was actually on a website that you could do it and all that good stuff so like i said we know 2k gonna always take something away and give it back but let's see what else he's talking about 2K22 updates. 
And that's what he said. Just stay tuned for more 2K22 updates. My biggest thing that I'm excited for is the seasons because I feel like seasons are what get people back into the game. With the season pass, all that good stuff, show us what rep rewards you can earn that season. And it's like, I may not hit max rep. Like the, the, I, we know that we're probably not gonna hit max rep ever. But the first person, like, it's like you're gonna be able to hit max rep like six or seven times during the year because I think it's gonna be a thing to max that season pass out and you know what I'm saying? And and to 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 be one of the first people to do that thing, man. So that's what I'm hoping. I'm hoping it's something like that. We don't really know, man. It all sounds good when you really don't think about it, but I just really feel like, I just feel like, you know, we will see, man. Um, Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Also, check out Breeze Tees. Hit us up on TikTok. All the links down in the description. Um, all the orders are out and we just ready to keep this thing rolling. And like I said, we got that transfer printer. Can I can I show y'all that real quick? Uh, I'm gonna show y'all the little transfer printer that we got, man. Let me see. We gonna go to Breeze Tees on here. Hold on. When second b-r-e-a-z there you go breeze tea bro we got this transfer printer man i gotta mute that because i don't want to look at that thing man any design you send us now boom we 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 you know what you're saying we able to print that joint right out and just uh do it and also if you got some business we got some giveaways and stuff like that going on over there too man but i'm just saying like like this is just dope like whatever whatever you got we can print it out exactly like it is Put it on a t-shirt, man. Look at this, this is one of my partners. This is uh, my partner, Chris. It's this little boy right here, man. We made him a shirt, it was his birthday. Boom, print it out, and look, look, boom, boom. Look, that's how I look on. Look at what I'm saying, man. Like, so, you know, like I said, we got the Christmas in July. We got shot glasses, all of that stuff. Everybody get up. It's time to jam now. You got a real jam going down. Welcome to the Space Jam. Here's your chance, dude. But that's too close to the, Sing it, AJ. That's too close to the source material right there, man. But anyway, like I said, you know, go on over to Breeze Tees, custom shirts and all that good stuff, man. And, uh, you know, we're going to holler at y'all next time, man. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section and hopefully uh, the seasons. I'm, I'm most excited for the seasons. I think that's going to be the dopest part. But uh, I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Until next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Guys, speak.